Village people, una do this one. Una follow this guy from Nigeria. Come UK. Village people, una de para, una de to vex. So this guy on my screen was chatting with a minor in the UK. And it's a huge crime for an adult to be having an inappropriate conversation with a minor. This man was chatting with a 14-year-old girl on a dating app. He's a married man with kids, but this man left his family to be chatting an underage girl. These are the kind of people that dent the images of Nigerians. You came to the UK to study rather than focusing on your studies and working hard to support your family back home. You are chatting an underage girl in an inappropriate manner. You know, get sense at your age, 43 years old man, you leave your family. What do you define on dating app? What are you doing there? If no be Ogun won't buy you. UK, don't play. This man is going straight to prison. After prison, he's going to be deported back to Nigeria. He doesn't deserve to be in the UK. Even without being told, you should know that you shouldn't be engaging in an inappropriate conversation with a minor, a 14-year-old girl. If you had a 14-year-old daughter and she's chatting inappropriately with a 43-year-old man, how would you feel about that? Try and picture that. How would you feel? You left home to come to abroad to hustle instead of focusing on your family. Even if say you won't play, you know, go go find women we don't come up for age. Single mothers full everywhere with a fine prick. Women we don't match up full everywhere, but I get where you go feel deceive. With sweets, you define. The girl was sending him images, inappropriate images. The guy they watch, they happy. He no no say that they track him. In the United Kingdom, nothing is hidden. It might take a while, but the law will definitely catch up with you in the future. You're going to be doing it, getting away with it, but someday the law will definitely catch up with you. This man's experience should serve as a warning to all Nigerians, all foreigners in the UK, not just Nigerians. When you're in the United Kingdom, you must follow rules and regulations. Do not chat underage girls. Here, not be Niger, one they misbehave. If underage girl even say hello to you, ignore them, they go where you they go. They, they put person for trouble for this country. If you see underage girl, they come, they run, my brother. As a man, never put yourself in a situation where you'll be stuttering, where you'll be talking like this guy was talking. She's a child. She's 14 years old. That's what I said. And you've just said to me that you could be speaking to others. Are you, have you been bullying these other children? I've never done that to my life. Well, you have, because I've got the evidence here. Sir, I told you. I said I'm just saying that for nothing's sake. I don't mean it. You don't mean it? I don't mean it. Sir. Why? Because of a break. My brothers, please focus on your hustle, especially when you're in a foreign land. That should be your priority. Imagine when the family members here say that 14 year old girl put out for trouble, make the report and come back to Nigeria. How are they going to feel about it? Whatever you do in life has consequences. Always think about the consequences. And in life, when you do the crime, you must do the time. I'm an OG. That's why I'm saying this to you. Oh, I love you, Radio God. And I can't keep repeating myself.